it's not undemocratic to try and persuade the electorate to think again about Brexit. In this important election for the next chair of the European movement, I'm going to be backing Patience Wheatcroft. Patience Wheatcroft would make a really brilliant chair of the European movement. She's collaborative, she works cross-party, she has real clarity and vision. I think hers would be a really powerful voice for the European movement, both inside Parliament and outside. I'm convinced that if the European movement is to make progress, it has to embrace diversity right across the political spectrum. And I just wanted to do a little message, give you my support to Patience Wheatcroft in her election, hopefully, to a leadership role in the European movement. Since we joined the EU, Britain has had an unprecedented period of peace and prosperity. We want a united Europe. We've had the benefit of that legacy. I want to hand it on to my children and to their children, and so do you. And we have to keep alive the thought that Britain will have a continuing strong future within Europe and that the damage that's been done can at some point be undone and the European movement has a big role to play in that. And I think Patience has the experience, the intellect, the connections to help play an important leadership role in that. presence in the House of Lords, where she now sits as an independent crossbench peer, and she has the capacity to get our message across. I also think she will be a unifying force that will listen with appreciation uh, to all the diverse views that are fed into her and will therefore be able to manage a harmonious operation within the centre of our movement. For all those reasons, I very much hope that you will consider giving her your support. Thank you. And uh, I'm back in patience. Bye-bye.